In this video, I'm going to show you a workout you can do to prepare for this year's Tough Man on the 5th of August at the Laugh Ballamore Farm. If you haven't signed up already, go to toughman.com and get yourself signed up before the closing date on the 9th of July. The workout in this video is going to focus on building strength to tackle the Tough Man obstacles under fatigue. In the Tough Man, you're going to come across a wide variety of obstacles. The first one being a 2km killer hill at the start of the course. So we are going to start the workout with a light 5 minute slow walk or jog. Build speed gradually until moving at a steady pace. Next, we are going to move on to a 5 minute flat gradient high intensity interval. 30 seconds fast pace, then 30 seconds active recovery, walk or jog. Then you're going to turn the incline up as high as possible and do a 15 minute interval, 30 seconds speed, 1 minute steady pace. Once you've completed your intervals, we will begin the circuit that will help develop your upper body strength and lower body explosiveness needed to tackle those climbing obstacles in this year's Tough Man Challenge. The circuit is as follows, 5 rounds, 5 exercises and 10 reps per exercise. The first exercise of the circuit is going to be wide grip pull ups. This exercise is going to be extremely important in tackling those climbing obstacles in the Tough Man Challenge. Keep your body as neutral as you can and try not to swing. Retract your shoulder blades at the top and lower yourself down slowly for 3 seconds. If you struggle with regular pull ups, try jumping pull ups instead. Jump to grab the bar high and lower yourself down slowly for 3 seconds. Or do squat rack pull ups instead. Set an upper bar fairly high on a stable squat rack. Do pull ups with your feet on the ground using your legs to help you when needed. <laughs> Next exercise of the circuit is tricep dips. Extend your arms, lifting your body up until your shoulders are over your hands. Then bend your elbows to lower your body until you feel your shoulder stretch. Then push back up to the start position. If you struggle with tricep dips, you can do them on a step. Placing your palms on the ends of a step and performing the same movement. The third exercise is the box jump. Stand with your feet, shoulder width apart and squat down. Swing your arms back, then swing your arms forward and explosively jump onto the box. Landing lightly, jump back off the box and repeat the exercise. If you don't have a box, you can do tuck jumps instead. Start with the feet, shoulder width apart, squat down and jump into the air. Tucking your knees to your chest, land with the legs bent and repeat the exercise. If you struggled with either of those exercises, you can perform a goblet squat instead. Using a kettlebell or weight close to the chest, keeping your feet shoulder width apart, bring your hips back, sit into the squat, keeping your chest up, drive the legs up and repeat the exercise. The next exercise is the plyo push up. Start with your elbows in an A shaped position, with your back straight and your hips neutral. Keep your chest close to the floor, then push yourself off the ground and add a clap in midair. Return to the start position and repeat the exercise. If you struggle with the plyo push ups, do regular push ups instead. Start in the same position, but extending your arms at the top and repeating the movement. Or you can do push ups with your knees on the ground. 
Keep your knees far away from your body so you can engage your core. The final exercise is alternate jumping lunges. Starting with your feet, hip width apart and both legs at 90 degrees. Jump off the ground and switch the feet in mid-air. You can't do jumping lunges, do normal alternating lunges instead. Keep in the same form the whole way, touching your knee to the floor. Once you've completed one round of the circuit, go back to the start and complete the circuit five times in total. If you're looking for a gym to train at, get yourself down to West Coast Fitness, Close Beg, Ballawatterworth Peel. We have lots of facilities to allow you to train however you want. We also run a Tough Man specific training session on a Sunday morning. And don't forget to go to toughman.com and get yourself signed up before the 9th of July.